Hello guys, welcome once again. In this video, I will show you how to add a chart control to your local database C Sharp Windows Form application. So let's get started. I will go to my toolbox and I will go to the data section here. And in here, you will find a chart control. Just drag and drop into your form and now you have chart control in your form right so let me just resize this chart control okay so now i have resized my chart control and now i want to link this chart control with my database so i already I have made this employee info database uh, from the starting of this video series. So let's see what's there in my database. So I have uh, two members in my database and I have name, surname and age here. So now for example I want to plot a graph of name versus age. So let's try and uh, uh, build a graph for name versus age. So I will go to the form and I will select my chart control and I will go to the properties. And in here I will go to the property called data source. So just search for this property called data source and in here you will be able to see your uh, database which is employee info binding source from here or if you are not able to so see the database then you can just click add project data source and you will be able to just select your data source from here just click next and select your uh, data source from here and click next and because I already have the, this data source, so I don't need to do this. So I will just select my employee info binding source from here, which I have generated earlier in the earlier videos. So if you don't know where from where this uh, data binding source come from, just see the last videos. One of the initial videos I have shown you and I have shown you how to create a database and how to link it with your C sharp. So in the data source just select this employee info or whatever binding source you have and now go to the series property of this chart control and click in this connection and click this small button and in here we will just decide the X and Y axis of our chart so for example for on x axis i want the name and on the y axis i want the age okay so on the x axis i want to show a name and on the y axis i want to show age and i will click ok and when i run the program Now you will be able to see two names which is Mark and Julie from here and it, they, the graph is showing the ages. So Mark has age 23 so you see here and Julie has age 34 so you can see it from here. So in this way you can connect your chart control with your database what more you can do is you can just uh, select your chart and in this, in this series collection here you can change the chart type also so you can you have these options various options for example i want to choose this uh, pie chart so i select in the chart section chart type pie chart and I click OK and now you see the pie chart and now when you run the program you see the pie chart 
here okay and there are some other properties here which you can uh, uh, you can choose from here and you will be able to generate some of the very nice chart for example this palette you can decide which palette you want for example I will choose this fire palette and you see here all the colors have changed right and this has all the other properties just you need to play with these properties and see what happens here for example I want to change the border color I will change the border color as black and background secondary color I can choose some light color so in this way you can just change these properties so I hope you have enjoyed this video and learned something new this time please keep watching these videos and please rate comment and subscribe and bye for now